Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 24th. Okay, so the timing is fluid, and not every reading is for you, so keep that in mind. And when I say the timing is fluid, that means that this reading could resonate at any time. message today what is coming in ten of cups that's what's coming in Ten of Cups is happiness. It is abundance. It is a spiritual blessing of some sort. Oh, why did I give it show it reversed? Didn't come out reversed. I think that things are going to change. If there's been some sort of happiness or unhappiness, if there's been unhappiness, things are going to get better. It wasn't meant to be that way. It was meant to be happy, right? So there is some sort of abundance that is coming in regards to a relationship this is fulfillment a permanent love the storm is over blessing there may be more than one blessing i feel like we have some blessings that are coming this is complete happiness happy relationship happy home Two of Swords. Now, the Two of Swords is, well, it looks like somebody's haunted. They're haunted by their thoughts. They're torn. They don't know what to do. This is overwhelming. There's some sort of overwhelmingness here. Somebody may be hearing things, you know, they're hearing all kinds of voices. Do this, no, do this, no, do that, no, do this. There's some sort of struggle here. This is a, somebody is really struggling with making a decision, probably about a relationship. Or they've been struggling in the past because this is, I go from past to present. So this could be the power struggle of the past, torn, having a hard time, unsure. There's, there's definitely somebody here that is struggling with a difficult decision. And I feel like they're getting a lot of information from other people that they just don't want to hear. We could have somebody that is in denial. You know, this person has been in denial. They've been not listening, not listening to the voices, not listening to their head. Or they've been listening to the wrong people. Or they've been in trying to avoid the truth. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. You know, that's what it looks like to me. It's like, like somebody is saying, I don't want to hear it, but it it needs to be heard. So I feel like we, we have somebody here that is really struggling in regards to a relationship. Because this is a relationship. Um, hmm. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. That's, that's what I believe I hear. Ooh, two of wands. This is, it, and it's interesting because this is a relationship. Twos are about partnerships. So we definitely have somebody that is struggling in regards to a decision or a choice in, in regards to a relationship, a partnership. This is being at that crossroads. We've got somebody definitely that is having a hard time not listening. You got somebody whispering in this person's ear as well. So there's... It's like, this is tough. It is a painful, stressful decision. Do I stay or do I go? Somebody has been blocking the truth or blocking their emotions. They've been protecting themselves, refusing to listen to their gut or refusing to listen to, uh, I feel like it's their gut. I feel like they've been refusing to listen to their gut and they've been listening to somebody else. I feel like there's some sort of demons here as well. We have somebody here that is, is really haunted by the looks of things. 
and they are really struggling very much so struggling two of wands this is being at that crossroads needing to make a choice there's a there's a lot of uh complacency here this is a this is a i feel like it's a major choice this person wants to go now this is the past there's def this definitely has to do with a, a home or a family or a permanent love or a permanent relationship there's an opportunity for a blessing here there's this is a blessing in abundance but the struggle is absolutely real there's a choice between two options obviously there's two paths here there's two options and the person that is making the choice is definitely struggling very very much there's options there's two options and we have somebody that here that can't decide at the moment They've all obviously been avoiding. Maybe they've been avoiding commitment. Knight of Wands reversed. Ace of Pentacles reversed. So this is a loss, a lost opportunity, a missed opportunity, unplanned. Somebody did not plan effectively. They may have uh, done something reckless or they're going to be doing something reckless. They may have done something stupid. Knight of Wands reverse, that's reckless behavior. Could also be a sudden departure. Could be a sudden unplanned loss of some sort there's no passion somebody is probably in a passionless partnership there there's there's probably there could be no growth there's no passion there's no desire ace of pentacles reverse is a lost opportunity it's something that is slipping away doesn't want responsibility we got somebody here that is throwing a golden opportunity away because they don't want responsibility they want to be on the move you know they don't it feels like they don't really want to settle down but there's an opportunity for happiness here this person doesn't want to listen they are they're very very well they may be trying to protect themselves. There's something to do with the commitment as well. Two of Wands. This is a this is a painful, stressful decision. This person is still thinking about it. It feels like they're being told, they're receiving messages from spirit guides or angels or their gut, and the and they're, and they're ignoring the messages that they're receiving. Somebody is ignoring ignoring the messages. And they're being poked, and they're being poked a lot. It's like they're being haunted by this relationship they are somebody is being haunted by a relationship whoever this person is that is being haunted is taking on this knight of wands in reversed energy this is somebody that is uh maybe this person is very boastful very reckless very showy could be a show off this is somebody who doesn't stick around um always on the move may have a chip on their shoulder having an unplanned loss or has thrown something away because of I don't want responsibility I don't really want the responsibility somebody could be suddenly leaving a relationship I just being honest okay this could be a sudden departure this is a relationship moving home they make a sudden decision this is very sudden extremely sudden to let something go and if that's what they're doing, it's because they're being haunted by something. Oh, 
There's another choice. There's another option. The lover's reverse. This is conflict, a disconnection, a detachment, a one-sidedness. We have a separation that is coming. We definitely have a separation that is coming. We have, we have an individual here that has another option. They, they do. They have another option. And I feel like they are struggling with the decision. We have decision, decision, decision. They are very much just struggling. Struggling with letting go of a passionless situation. And, but, and, and it feels like they do have this other option that they have engaged with. Um, they already know this person. But they, they, they aren't listening to their gut. They are definitely not listening to their gut. Um, this is a huge loss with the Ace of Pentacles reversed. We have a show off, a boastful, prideful individual here who uh, is in some sort of contract with the wrong person. The lovers is a contract that's not desirable. The lovers reversed. Okay, that's that's a contract, but I feel like there's going to be a separation. There's a relationship here that is not meant to be, unfortunately. Um, and I think that we have somebody that is has been torn. They've been really, really, really torn, torn between their two options. And but I feel like now, I feel like there's going to be something that happens suddenly because this is an extremely sudden. Um, A three of cups reverse. There is third party interference here. This party is over. There's nothing to celebrate. This is a lack of emotional growth. There is parting ways from a friendship or a relationship. There's a termination. This is an unplanned uh, termination by the looks of things or unplanned separation. I think it comes very, very, very suddenly. I mean, I hate to give this message. And it's interesting that I took that out and I turned it around and reversed. It was supposed to be reversed. Oh, that's why I did it. And I didn't realize it at the beginning. Remember, every word that comes out of my mouth is part of this reading. I didn't, re I didn't realize it at the beginning. I'm sorry, but I got to do it. Okay, y'all saw it happen. And I know some people only want to hear the positive, but if you don't if you don't hear the negative, you never you wouldn't know about the positive. If you didn't see the darkness, you wouldn't know about the light. It's it's our darkest moments that teach us that that bring us into the light. That show us who we are. That help us to rise, that bring us strength. It's the negative things in our life that bring us growth. So yeah, I understand there's a lot of people that only want to hear the positive. Those people are not in reality. That's not reality. They're, they must be young souls or they're, they... are in fantasy. It's kind of like the justice card. It's kind of like the scales. There's two sides to everything. So anyway, I do see parting ways from a relationship. I feel like somebody got into something extremely fast. They didn't, they weren't practical. I feel like they have some sort of regrets. And I feel like they got themselves into a relationship um, that wasn't meant to be. Probably it was based on lust or pride or ego. Now they are haunted and I feel like they want to break free, but they're struggling to break free. And I feel like pride is in the way. Anyhow, I do see a separation here. I feel like this party is over. I feel like... Uh, A decision is being made to let something go that is not, there's no emotional growth, there's no happiness, there's no joy, there's nothing to celebrate, right? This is parting ways. So there is going to be parting ways. This is unplanned, unstable, 
something is being taken away or it's going away or it's slipping away. And this is unhappiness and this is unhappiness. I feel like we also have this person that has been struggling over a loss of a relationship, of a partnership that isn't meant to be. And maybe their pride and their ego is in the way. And that's just saying it a little bit differently. This could be for you. The person that is watching this that is struggling with letting go of a partner that is engaged to, to somebody else or is partnered up with somebody else. This is definitely about a partnership. It's about a relationship that isn't meant to be. It's a, it's a contract that is over. But there is some sort of pride that is in the way. And there is a need to let go. So there is, there is a struggle. The struggle is really, really real. This is a separation from a relationship, but this is ignorance. It is. We got somebody here that is just not listening. This is making a decision to let go in part ways. Suddenly. Now, this could be a friendship, it could be a love relationship, it could be a family member. So, I do believe that there is going to be a decision that is made, this is in the future, to let something go that it doesn't bring happiness. Okay, there's no reunion here, there's no togetherness, there's third party interference, there's a lot of gossiping, there's ganging up, there's. Uh, Oh, third party interference, there's there's boastfulness, there's pride, there's ego, there's reckless behavior, there's force, there's over overly competitiveness, there's a lot of competitive competitiveness here with both of these cards. Somebody is letting go, they are terminating the friendship or they are terminating the relationship because it's not meant to be, it's not compatible. Somebody is attached to a non-compatible -com partnership and this is uh, letting go it is letting go of that partnership this is making the decision somebody has been and I feel like what they've been haunted not listening but that's in the past it feels like you see the change in the look here and it's, it's different okay these, these look like I don't know haunted this is like an angel it's like finally realizing in this one's face finally realizing I have to I have to this is this is a new vision it's it's finally starting to listen so somebody I do believe that somebody is starting to listen I feel like there's a sudden uh, termination of the contract, whatever the contract is. King of Wands, that's action oriented. The King of Wands is given to take action, very decisive. It's absolutely making the decision. The decision is now being made. This is uh, somebody that is taking ownership, that is, is taking charge. I feel like it's a very sudden decision that is being made. This is a this is and because this is unplanned and this is sudden and this is sudden. It is a this is an unplanned thing. It's like it's it's all of a sudden it's just time. It's time to get up and go. very interested how that came out I, in my hand it was upright but then when I went to put it down it was reversed and I tried and I tried to change it. it you can't make it if it's not meant to be right here it's not meant to be I tried to change it it wasn't meant to be do you understand what I'm saying if it's not meant to be you can't force it and there is force here somebody's been trying to force a relationship that isn't meant to be it doesn't work like that. You can't force it. Good luck. 